Hi, this is Tutor Nick P, and this is noun phrase 87. The noun phrase today is fire bug. Okay, let's take a look at the note here. Uh, a fire bug uh, could also be referred to as a pyromaniac, yeah, somebody that has a mental problem that they just love to start fires. Okay, uh, this is someone who enjoys setting fires just for the fun of it. Uh, a fire bug gets a thrill to watch fires burn. So that's what a fire bug actually is. Okay, uh, let's continue with the note here. Bug by itself uh, means to have a strong, sudden enthusiasm for something. So you could say somebody's got a bug for something. Uh, this is a common one. We sometimes might say a travel bug. So I gave one example of that. Uh, that backpacker caught the travel bug. So if he went somewhere and he started traveling and then he loved it and he's got to go back and got to travel again and again and again, and he wants to just keep going to more and more places, you say he caught, somebody caught the travel bug. Or really it could be anybody, as long as they, they love their trips and they just want to keep making many, many other trips, we say somebody caught a travel bug. So you can kind of put it together. You can kind of figure out why we say fire bug. Okay, now this, this has nothing to do with the bug that actually can light up. That's actually called a firefly. But a fire bug is somebody that really just loves to set fires. Okay, let's continue. Um, all right, therefore, a fire bug has a lot of enthusiasm for watching things burn. This is different uh, from the word arsonist. An arsonist is someone who starts illegal fires but it may not be for excitement. So technically a fire bug, you know, they are mostly starting fires illegal. So in most cases, fire bugs really are arsonists as well. But an arsonist may not be a fire bug. He may have very different reasons for starting the fire. He may not like it. He may not like watch, to watch things burn at all. So let's continue. Uh, other reasons. All right, so there may be other reasons such as insurance fraud. That's a common reason why sometimes fires are started. Somebody took out insurance and they thought this is a good way to make money. They had a fire start or, or possibly they paid someone to start the fire. Maybe they didn't do it themselves. So that could be another reason why an arsonist starts a fire. Somebody paid him to start this fire. Could also be related again to the insurance fraud. Um, them to do it or possibly a revenge crime. Somebody, maybe they have an enemy, they hate this person, they, uh, they want to start this fire to hurt someone. Um, you know, maybe not necessarily to kill them, but maybe, you know, to damage their property or something. In that case, uh, that's another reason somebody could be an arsonist. So an arsonist starts illegal fires, but an arsonist may not be a fire bug. Okay. All right, and here's a couple of examples we might use with fire bug. All right, so example number one, uh, when that mother discovered her son was a fire bug, she decided to bring him to a psychiatrist for help. Yeah, this is terrible. There are cases like this where fire bugs, sometimes it starts very young. Sometimes it's like a young kid that might be the first time that he starts a fire. Okay, let's look at number two here. Uh, that fire inspector thinks this recent series of fires, so it might be inspecting a number of fires, uh, may have been set by a fire bug. So maybe he's suspicious because maybe he can't find any other reasons why these fires may have been set. Okay, anyway, I hope you got it. I hope it's clear. Thank you for your time. Bye-bye.